Hey everyone, Technometry with the video for you guys. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to fix your iPhone camera crashing on the iPhone 16 Pro Max or any iPhone 16 lineup. This seems to be a common issue that a lot of people are experiencing. You can follow these steps to fix it. So let's get started. The very first thing I recommend doing is closing out the camera app if you have it running like that by swiping up. Again, all you're going to do is if it's open, just swipe it up and then reopen it. That's gonna be the quick and easy fix for it. The next thing you wanna do is, because the iPhone 16 uh, Pro Max and the 16 has actual camera button right here, this can sometimes get obstructed if you have like a case or something blocking it if you accidentally touch and click on it. It's very sensitive, so well, there is some issues going on right now. As you can see, if I click on it, it launched. Sometimes there's weirdness going on. Sometimes some cases make you accidentally press it hold it so try to make sure that the case that you're using does not interfere with this camera control I recommend taking that off also if you have any dust or lint build up clean it with a microfiber cloth as well anything that could get in the way of that camera button although it's good that they may put this one it can also interfere with the camera uh, performance now the next thing you wanted to go ahead and do is follow the step which is you're going to Quickly press and release the volume up, quickly press and release the volume down, and then hold on to the side button until the screen goes completely black and the Apple logo appears. So make sure you don't touch the screen while you do this process. Quickly press and release the volume up, volume down, and then hold on to the side button just like that until the screen goes completely black. And we're gonna wait for the Apple logo to appear, ensuring that you do not touch the screen. So as you can see here, I'm holding on to that side button on my right hand side and then I let go once I see the Apple logo. This is known as a forced restart, basically shuts down the phone software, reloads the code. So if it's a software related issue causing your camera to crash, it should go ahead and fix it. This method will not delete any of your personal data. So all of your photos, videos, apps will still be on your phone. And if you can't get it the right the first time, keep on trying it again. It's just quickly pressing and releasing the volume up, volume down before holding on to this side button. Now after you have done that and you're still experiencing issue, you're gonna go into your setting on your iPhone and then go to uh, general and then scroll down which says transfer reset iPhone, click on reset and you're gonna to wanna to do a reset of all settings. Now this is resetting all the settings themselves, especially if you got a new iPhone. It will not delete any of your data like your photos, videos, apps or anything like that. It'll reset things like the network, the keyboard, home screen layout, handwriting, and location privacy setting. But it's kind of necessary to do if you're experiencing that camera still crashing on you. Now finally, the last troubleshooting step we can give is based on Apple support is that they're gonna be releasing a software update that can fix phones that are experiencing this and it is a known bug that's going around. So we should see a setting in our settings in general, software update, we're gonna to wait to see if there's an update available and as you can see here, there's the update currently available to fix important bug fixes and security on the iPhone 16, 16 Plus, 16 Pro, and the 16 Pro Max. So you want to go ahead and update your phone to it and wait for the next update as well if you're still experiencing those camera issues. And I hope troubleshooting help you guys fix your camera crashing. If so, please do consider the like and subscribe button. Also, if you found a better way to fix it, do share with us in the community so everyone can also benefit from it in the comment section. Thanks for watching, guys. See you guys next time.